Hey, what's up, everyone? Bubble Kings here, and welcome back to some more Paladins. And today, we're going to be playing Maldamba. Haven't played him in ages. Uh, we're going to try the Mending Spirit Legendary here. So now we have like a an additional 300 health upfront heal when we hit people with Healing Serpent. Uh, Mending Spirit, sorry. Uh, so we've got Eerie Presence, so even if we miss it, the cooldown will be so low on and we can cast it again. Got some good cooldown reduction, some movement speed for allies, some self-healing, and sliver distance as well, so we don't get caught, hopefully. I'm um, going up against a double tank cop with a macaw, so we just got to make sure we don't get hooked. They have two healers, a mave, and two tanks, okay. Let's heal him before he gets in there. Um, oh, shit. Give him some healing. Give him some healing. Give him some more healing. Let's throw out a snake. Get some people healing. Some more people healing. Oh, it is actually... That's actually not too bad. We have a lot of people that want to get, like, super deep. So, <laughs> we're actually able to get a lot of people down with the gourd. I'm sort of just trying to, um... Hit people with the healing spirits when I can. Just keep them topped off. Let's keep Cassie in there. She's really the only one with us, so we sort of need her alive. Oh, no. Get the heals down. Oh, man. Is he gonna die? Oh, I missed him. He went behind the wall. He's down as well. Okay. It might be a good idea to pull back Cassie. Okay. Nice job. Let's keep the heals going. Oh, she's so dead. I'm gonna try and get to her. Maybe. Okay. Let's try and stun someone. Oh, shit, I walked back too early. We don't have any reload speed, so. Um. Uh. Oh, shit. Okay, I'm trying to keep position behind our tank so he can keep protecting us, but. It's obviously not the easiest thing in the world. Take this out. Uh. Try and get healing to our Cassie as well. Okay. 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 He's dead. Jeez. I'm gonna try and get out of this. Throw that down for our friends. Oh, we're in a bad position here. I'm just gonna reload. Oh, nope. She's gone as well. Let's go regroup with our friends back here if we can. Uh, watch out for them. Where's our team going? Let's follow this guy around this way, maybe. Give him some heals. Our team's going around the other way, so I'm going to try and group over there with him. Oh, come on. Okay, we got the heals. Oh, no. Too slow on that one. Get another heal on him. Wind it up again. No, stay still. Okay. Someone go behind us. I thought someone went behind us. Oh, okay. missed stun. Oh, no. Oh, shit. Okay. We're fine. Stay still. Okay. Ooh. We survived, but I used my ult there, which kind of sucks. Okay, keep them um, up. Oh, nice stun. Jeez, okay. We're not getting too many hits off, but we're getting the healing down. I think that's the main thing. Probably could be getting a bit more damage down if we tried a bit harder, though. Okay, can we get a stun down? Oh, we did. We chained it with his stun. Nice. Okay. I'm going to throw it inside there so he can stay inside there and be okay. Nice. Oh, we got CC. Someone stay on the payload, please. Oh, we got him. We got him. Oh, my God. Nice job. I don't think we died. Wow, that was, um, that was really good by our team there. 
So our guy's actually going with the stun legendary here. I don't know if that's the... Is that what people are going for now with the Terminus nerf on um, his legendary, the protection one? Maybe they are. That was pretty good there. It goes through Makoa's shield as well. And that was good because it meant we could chain our um, stun after his stun. And Makoa was pretty much sitting on the floor the whole game. Um, the whole fight there. Uh, I want to get some... I think I want to get some defensives, maybe. If I stay alive, I'm doing a pretty good job of keeping our tanks alive and stuff like that. So, if we can keep them topped up. Gonna give him a heal before he goes in. Okay. Give him a heal. Give him another heal. Oh no! Uh oh. I can't see where they are. Oh my god. Oh, did you hit him? No. Going around this way again. Oh. No. Oh, I'm so dead. Damn. Oh, man, that was rough. We didn't have our all up either. It kind of sucked. That would have helped us a bit with the end fight there, but they pretty much had the point at that point. Get out of there before we die. Get some more healing down. Whoop! Oh, we have to make it Zin instead of. I mean, we hit casting instead of Zin. Tank guy's going down at the front. Let's get around to this side so we can stop him moving in, maybe. Okay. Oh no. Our tank's down again. Oh no. Oh, we got pulled into a fear. Damn. No chance. I think they got this one. Yeah. Oh man. Ooh. Okay. Let's try something else. We kind of all got really split up right at the start. If we're all going to flank around the left side, we have to stay together after, I think. Because we sort of all ran around the left side. We didn't find anyone initially, and then we all split up. If we, like, all ran together onto the point, I think we would have been okay. Like, if we went left, came around the back, and then ran on or something like that. Four, three, two, hmm. one. Nicole's got quarter right level 3, so he's going to stop a lot of our healing. Let's get out of here a bit. Oh, I can't heal him for that. Not much I can do there. Not much I can do about that either. Whoop. Nope. Not much I can do about that either. Okay. Nice stun by a friend there. Oh, but that ult. I thought he was going to get stunned, but... He activated his ult to get out of it. Man, this thing for rolling for us this round, though. Jeez. It went from, like, us just clutching out that first round to getting steamrolled for here. Hmm. Can we get 
get some people. Watch out. Oh, no. Damn it. Kill him out. Oh, shit. Oh, okay, I hit the wrong person with it. Oh, man. Man. Oh, man. <laughs> this is so. This thing's going on everywhere. Trying to keep him alive. Oh, he missed the hook. I think there's a mate. Did the mate come around the side? I think she did. She is around here somewhere. So watch out in front of us, so. And Droxus. Oh, I got the heal on him, but I don't think that's going to be enough. Oh, no, that's our Cassie down as well. Oh no. Trying to give him enough healing, but. Oh, there's people everywhere. Oh no. Oh, damn, I'm down. Oh, there's just so much going on. We haven't been dying much, but a team is just getting steamrolled over. Oh my god. Oh no, I got taken out. Oh, he's got his ult going. That's so hard for our team to deal with. The Makaro. Oh, Zin's trying to do some work though. Trying to dodge around. No. Damn. I felt like we didn't play too bad. Though. I think we got a lot of healing off. I think we needed to get more stuns down though. The problem is we didn't have too much reload speed, but... I feel like, yeah, I definitely should have focused on getting some more stuns down there. Because I was getting the healing down. I think I was definitely getting enough healing down. It's just... I wasn't providing enough CC, which is a big part of Maldamba. Oh man. I should have been just trying to get less shots off for damage and getting more healing off or something like that. I'm not healing more CC off. Because yeah, we did decent healing, but... Uh, we just don't have the CC to lock them down with the stun from... Um, What's the name here? How did everyone else go on our team? Not too bad. Some okay damage. They were pretty similar on both sides. We did it pretty similar to the ML Dharma, except we did a um a lot more healing. Yeah. Which is actually surprising. They have double tanks, so you think they should end up being well the ML Dharma should be doing more healing. Cause he can get more people in the goal and stuff, but we actually had a pretty decent team for our Gord. Zin was pretty far deep. Um, same with Terminus, he was jumping super far deep. Uh, Cassie and Androxus all going super deep on the enemy. So if I threw it on the enemy, our team could just run straight onto him and get the healing at the same time. It was actually pretty good. Our team come for um, some of the healing we are doing. Which was a bit surprising. You don't expect it uh, with a single tank comp to... Get some decent healing down with like a gourd, especially with two flankers. Uh, we missed a couple of the right clicks, but we did have a uh, what's the name mending spirit eerie presence thing here, so didn't really matter too much. Though, even though we missed some, you can see we still got the healing down anyway. But yeah, I'm not too sure. I think we need to group up a bit better, take down some more priority targets. I don't think we should have ran onto the point straight away like we did, because the thing is. Terminus has to get so close to the enemy, and it's such a, like, it's a quite a long, like, choke point, I guess you can say. Like, it's like a really long hallway, the point. So, if he doesn't come around and flank him or something, he's just going to get shot down before he even gets close. 
So that kind of sucks. Because if he has to use his leap to get in, then he can't, you know, follow him up when they use their escape to just get away from him when he leaps in. So. But yeah, that first round was a bit surprising. I'm surprised we actually um, pushed that all the way in. We got like a really good momentum going after we uh, got stopped there. But yeah. That was interesting. Um, I think with the cards, maybe we should have went with... Uh, what's name? Wrecker. We didn't really have a Wrecker on our team, and they had double shields. And their shielding actually did block a bit of damage, so... We might have been able to help with that, but our damage isn't too high anyway. But it was blocking a lot of our damage and our, like, stuns and stuff, so we couldn't really get them through. It's a bit unfortunate. Oh, but I think the Haven was really useful. There was a couple of times where Maeve was trying to jump onto us, and we lived just because we had that extra damage reduction, so it did help out. I think Androxus was getting picked off too much, though. Like, that score line. <laughs> this shows he was getting picked off way too much. He got damage down because he was being super aggressive, but he wasn't able to convert it into anything, and instead he was just giving over kills. It kind of sucked. Oh, I think it was a bit similar to Zim, but he did a bit better. He actually got the kills down. So, yeah. Interesting game. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys next time.